So this is called Sunnyside. Thank you for downloading the Sunnyside demo. Sunnyside has been a four year long journey of creativity, dedication, sacrifice, and pushing the boundaries. It is still a work in progress. So we humbly ask that you not let any bugs or issues hold you back from enjoying the rest of the game. Before you move to Sunnyside, please select what type of homesteading experience you would enjoy most. The game mode will impact the behavior of certain systems across the game. You can change your game mode at any time. There's cozy mode. Battles are simple, less frequent, XP gain rate is normal, rare item drop is increased, crop and resource harvest quality is increased. We have RPG mode. Game economy has increased difficulty. Battles are complex challenge. Okay, we're just gonna do cozy mode. It's Saturday. I'm not about that life. I want cozy mode. Oh, everything's coming in. <laughs> Oh, it's me. We can wear watches. No, you can't be wearing watches. Okay, that's fine. Let's be this. Oh! Oh my god, we are immediately addicted to our phone. Um, first name and last name? Oh, geez. I'm typing right on there. Oh, okay. Oh God, it's, wait, wait, I'm, I'm an old millennial. We got to do it from this angle. <laughs> I'm so cool looking. I'll never be that cool looking in real life. Oh, I have a friend called Akira. I finally did it. I did. What? Welcome to the future. It's not that exciting. My only sibling finally joins the world of social media. It's exciting. Besides, I need to keep tabs on you somehow. I'm not a child. No, but I still care about you. I know, but we talked about it. My screen is like... It has a little texture on it like I've scratched the crap out of it. If it's in the light. If it's not in the light, it looks okay. Kind of? Yeah, the screen looks awful. It looks uh, like I do not know how to take care of my phone. Uh, what's the town like? Dunno. Train dropped me in Higashi. Uh, I'll have to catch a bus from here. Where am I going? The farm? A bus? So it's in the middle of nowhere. The land is cheap and probably the only thing I'll ever be able to afford. It's an opportunity. Sometimes you have to leap when opportunity comes. Just because the listing was cheap doesn't mean you'll win. Only one way to find out. This is the way I dress to go to a farm that I just bought? Well, I'm here for you no matter what happens. Thanks, Akira. What are big sibs for? Let me know how it goes. I will. Oh my god, it's, such, it's persona transitions. Here I go. Was that guy not jogging by before? He's a creeper. That lady is also jogging in regular clothes. Quick, did we learn any of that kanji in our last game? I don't think so. <laughs> oh, here's my bus. We've unlocked new songs. <gasps> bus, bus. I'm pretty sure that means bus. Basu. Oh my God, what do I have to like walk up a hill also? Jeez, how far is this? 
How far away is this place? Welcome everyone, thank you for being here. My name is Mayumi and I'm a member of the Sunnyside City Council. We'll start the auction in just a moment. We appreciate your patience. Wait, don't we get to see the place? Says angry stranger. Cautious stranger says, how do I even know if I want it or not? Oh, hero, a real person. The land tour was yesterday. It was listed in the advertisement. Who are you? This is Hiro. He is also a member of the council. You expect me to buy a property sight unseen? Well, no one's expecting you to buy it, stranger. Just leave. All right, everyone, let's begin. So wait, I, I was under the impression from our text conversation that I had already purchased a property, but I just took a train and a bus and walked up a dark hill for the opportunity to purchase a property? Interesting. What a waste of my time. Well, then leave, sir. Then leave. Dang, I missed the property tour? Oh, well, how bad can it be? Here goes nothing. All right, everyone. Starting price is 350 cupules. 350. Do I have 400? I guess we're going to bid because we... Otherwise, there's no game to play. Oh, anyone for 450? 600! What? Anyone for 650? 700! Okay, let's not bit. Let's not raise it too much. 700. Does anyone want 750? 800? How much money do I have? I don't know. 850? Wow, this is getting really expensive. 850? 850! 850 over here. Anyone for 900? 900. Alright, 850 going once. 850 going twice. If I don't bid down, I'm going to lose my opportunity. 900 to my friend in the back. Anyone for 950? Going once, going twice. Sold for 900. See Hero to finalize your property deed. Thank you, everyone. Well, all right. This guy looks like Mutt from the first season of Schitt's Creek. If you don't know who that is, look it up right now, and he looks exactly like him. Hey, congrats. Name's Gabriel. Mayumi says, I'm supposed to give you a ride to your new place once you've settled up the taxes and the paperwork. All right. I'll wait here. Come find me when you're ready to go. Why? Why should I be expected to have... Why should I be expected to get a ride? They don't know I took a bus here. Use E to interact with different items, including talking to various people in town. Move your character, move the camera. You can also use right click for a close and look and aim mode. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Hello there, my name is Mayumi Okada. Pleased to meet you. Hi, I'm Sunny. I just want to say, I'm very happy you decided to move to Sunnyside. Thank you. It's a nice little town. You'll love it here. I hope so, yeah. And if the residents give you a hard time, please let me know. Uh -huh. Not that that's going to happen, of course, but just in case. Also, I'm the only doctor in town, so if you ever need anything, the clinic is on Main Street. Can't miss it. Thank you. Remember, it's important to maintain your health. Don't just wait until there's a problem. Okay. All right. I also like to do yoga in the park across the street in the morning. You're welcome to join that as well. Thank you, Dr. Okada. Please call me Mayumi. All right. See you around and good luck on your farm. All right, you're the guy for taxes, I heard. Congratulations if you'll just sign these documents, please. Oh no. 
That looks complicated. I'm gonna name it Sunnyside because that's what we named it in um, in Coral Island. Farm. Wait, if we put farm, it might say farm farm. We'll just name it that. Uh, all set. Welcome to Sunnyside. Thank you. By the way, I noticed your phone is cracked. Oh my god, that was intentional. Come by Tech Hero later. I'll get that fixed up for you. Oh, thank you. That's kind. Neighbors need to support each other, right? Are you going to do it for free? Oh my gosh. Um, should we go talk to, like, everyone? Your phone is your connection to many systems and menus in the game, as well as how you communicate with other people in town. You can open it with F. Through the course of the game, you will unlock various apps for your phone, so be sure to check it off then. Oh my god, look how cr it is cracked. Alright. Um, do we get rid of it with F too? Hello. Sako. A fresh new face! I can't wait to become friends! Alright. Hmm, you seem young to be a landowner. Yeah, I know. I really don't like playing this with keyboard and mouse. I very much will need to play this on PlayStation if we get this game. Many tutorials will be available through the beginning stages. Some will appear as pop-ups and others will only be unlocked with a small notification on the right. All of these tutorials can be found in your phone. Okay. Sorry, I'm busy with official council work. Okay. All right, Mutt, can we go? You ready then? Yes. Well, here it is. Here what is? Uh, your new home? But, but what? Where's the house? Huh? Isn't there a house on the land? Uh, there was, but it fell apart years ago. What? Where am I supposed to sleep? Oh, right. Council gave me a tent to build for you. There's a random fox just coming up behind us. Okay, bye. Hang on. I also don't understand why it's the council's problem that I don't have anywhere to sleep. <laughs> Alright. Thank you, Gabriel. You're all set now. Welcome to Sunnyside, neighbor. Neighbor? Yep, got a ranch just on the other side of the river. Hope you like animals. You may hear some mooing occasionally. What have I gotten myself into? Are you alright? This is gonna be interesting. I'm fine. Just a lot to take in. Yeah, I get that. Anyway, I think there's an old shed by the water pump. Well, why can't I just stay in the shed then? I'll bet there's some tools in there to help you get started. Anything you don't find in there, you can probably get from Ishikawa. Kawa! Kawa! Did we not just learn that was river? Or Sota. Sota? Yep, Sota's family owns the garden center in town. So, seeds and watering cans and stuff? Watering cans? What is this, 1996? You might be in the country, but it's not the Edo period. There's a hose on the shed like a normal farm. Okay. He's very angry about my watering can. Right. Because this is all so normal. If anyone asked, I did my part and showed you to the place. Okay. Thank you. You've been really helpful. Well, now hang on. Let's be clear. I'm not a knight in shining armor, okay? Just because I helped you out doesn't mean I'll be running to your rescue all the time. You're going to have to work hard if you want to last longer than the others. Got that? I'm sorry. Did I offend you? I just said thank you. I literally just said thank you for helping me because he helped me. <laughs> no. It's just, I've got my own place to look after, you know? Yeah, I literally just said thank you for helping me, sir. That's it. That's all I said. But just look at you. You're going to have a rough few weeks. <sighs> all right, come by my house for lunch. 
At least a neighbor can do is feed you, I guess. But you just said, I'm sorry for what I said. I'll text you around lunchtime, okay? Okay, I don't like the, the I don't like the way this relationship is starting out. Guess I better look around. All right, Akira's gonna flip out. What that you moved to a hole in the woods? You moved to a hole in the woods. Okay, so this is a shed. So I can't really sleep in the shed because it's not closed. But you know, what's this? It's like a water tank. Pump water. Cardboard box. I have an, a bucket. I have a digging fork. And I have a nata. Cutting grass and bunching bamboo. I'm gonna assume that means grass. Let's cut some grass down. We also have a bento box, which I'm assuming is like for food. A harvest basket, a tackle box, a fishing basket, and battle pack. I got a fanny pack for battle. Okay, should we try to cut down grass, I guess? How do I... Do I have to put it in my... Maybe I have to put it here? Okay, now I'm holding it. I did it. I did it. got grass. Um, wait. Oh, he's texting me. That took me too long. Uh, we still on for lunch? Um, yeah, I'm on my way. That looks great. Thank you. Uh, eat the burger. Yeah, I eat the burger. It's not much, but you can always count on me for a good burger and some grilled veggies. Are they a favorite? You know, not really, no. But they're easy to make and bring back good memories. How did you cook this? It's smoky. On the charcoal grill. Pretty common for vegetables here in Japan. But burgers, not so much. Very common in the US though. Is that where you're from? Yep. Moved to Japan with my father when I was barely a teenager. We lived in the city though. Honestly, I wish he'd taken us somewhere more like Sunnyside. But life is what you make it, I guess. How long have you lived here? Been in Sunnyside for about 15 years now. How about you? Where are you from? The capital. <gasps> like in the Hunger Games? Oh, that's a big change. Just a bit. What were you doing before you bought that old overgrown plot? Like for work? Yeah. Um, I worked in uh, hospitality. I was working in the hospitality industry, restaurants, hotels, that kind of thing. Oh yeah, definitely a big change then. Regretting the decision yet? To buy the farm? No. Not at all, I'm looking forward to the challenge. And a new start. Hey, that's the spirit, good for you. You're gonna need all the help you can get. Luckily, Sunnyside is full of good people. You'll find a way. That's kind of you to say. Just warning, I'm not flirting with you, sir. I just said that's kind of you to say. Just so you, we don't get any weird ideas about what I'm trying to tell you. I'm just trying to be civil and nice to you. When I first moved here, gosh, back when Lucy was no taller than my knees. I'll tell you, this property was a mess. Former owners abandoned it. The townsfolk were good to me. They really helped me fix the place up and get started. Most of them moved on now, though. Mm. <sighs> I guess it's up to me to help you then, isn't it? Dude, I I don't want to impose. I also kind of don't want to talk to you. No, no. It's the right thing to do. Well, 
first two things you gotta figure out are food and shelter. It's gonna take you a little while for your first crop to come in. So you'll probably need to get food from Sockos for now. You can also forage for things like berries and mushrooms. Shelter, well, you've got that tent. It's only gonna last you for so long though, so we're gonna need to figure out how to get you a house. Next thing you wanna figure out is water and electricity. <laughs> Should I be taking notes? This is a lot. Sorry, I guess dumping information on you isn't gonna help much. Don't wanna overwhelm you. How about we start we, you off with a small camping stove? Pretty sure we can get one from the outlet in Higashi. Outlet? Yeah, big appliance store. They'll have anything you need when it comes to furnishing your tent. You know how to cook, right? Nope. I think I burned instant ramen once. Right, maybe we should set you up with some cooking lessons with Hina. Just in case. Wait. You don't have a farming background, do you? I... What made you think I did? Did you even bring any seeds? Uh, no. <sighs> oh boy. This... This one. I'll be right back. There. This should help get you started. I got two potato seeds. Potatoes? Oh, actual potatoes. Yeah, you can plant them in the ground. What am I supposed to do with these? Well, I can't tell you everything, now can I? If you've got the farming spirit in you, you'll figure it out. And if I don't, you'll starve to death on that plot of land. Well, then I guess you're not going to last long, no matter how much I help. That's reassuring. I've got a good feeling about you, Sunny. I think you'll be fine. Mm-hmm, sure. Wait, we went to a place. Where'd we go? Oh, hi, Catherine. Are you building this house? I didn't realize anyone had bought the place. Though, come to think of it, the tent was a little weird. Uh, I just moved in. Yeah, I just built, I just moved in. Gabe built the tent for me. That's great. Welcome to Sunnyside. I'm Catherine Takashi. Everyone calls me Cat, though. Hi, Cat. It's a pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Sorry for dropping in randomly. It's just, well, this area is beautiful. I'm sorry, is this my land? Is this my house? Where are we? I'd like to come by and paint or do homework here. It's never been a problem because no one owned the place, but, well, I don't want to bother you. Oh, it's fine. You can come by. I'm lonely all the time. Thank you. The breeze over that hill is just so refreshing. And I'm glad the view isn't going to waste anymore. My grandma was really good friends with the original owners a long time ago. The kids moved away when I was really little, and I guess their parents passed away a few years back. Grandma used to say they never showed any interest in the place and that the property wouldn't stay in the family. I guess she was right. Natalie says a lot of families have been leaving Sunnyside for better opportunities in the city. Not me, though. I love it here. It's so peaceful. Uh, same. I mean, that's why I moved here, too. Right? Exactly. <laughs> right? Yeah. Okay, I'll admit the trees don't seem as vibrant as I remember. And there aren't nearly as many wild animals. I guess nature moves on, even moves on. But you haven't moved on. Nope, Sunnyside might not hold opportunities for everyone. But there's a lot here for me. Anyway, you're a farmer? Uh, not exactly. What do you mean? This will be my first time. You bought a farm and you don't know how to grow anything? Yeah. How brave! <laughs> I don't know about that. Seems courageous to me. Thanks. I'm such a great conversationalist. Gabe seemed pretty concerned. He was helpful though, I think. He gave me some potatoes? Oh my god, put them in the ground. What's wrong with you? Even if, you, even if you're like, I'm going to be a farmer and someone gave you something, wouldn't your first thought to be, I guess I'll put it in the ground? Because that's kind of what like farming is. I'm not sure what to do with them. Gabe gave you potatoes, but didn't tell you why? Ugh. Why is he such a jerk all the time? Do you have any idea? My guess is that he meant for you to plant them. Oh, I didn't even know you could do that. Yep, I don't really know anything else about growing potatoes, though. 
but I know a ton about growing strawberries. We just finished planting more for the season. We even have some extra seeds if you want them. That would be great. I can bring them by tomorrow morning on my way to class if you like. That's really kind of you. Thank you. Ugh, I gotta go. I have an essay due tomorrow and I haven't even started it yet. Bye. Bye, cat. She's interesting. Is this my house? Do I magically have part of a house? Where are we? I'm confused. Is this my property? Where we were? This is my property! Oh my gosh! I have part of a house. What's moving? Was that the sun? Okay. Um, oh wait, we learned how to do this. Oh. Maybe this is where you're supposed to grow things. Okay, so let's switch to this. Oh yay, it is gridded. Okay. Where would my potatoes be? Oh, there they are. Okay. Yay! So, as far as water, I'm pretty sure... How far does this go? Okay. Okay. I just made a big old mess. I would really love to get um, a car, but I guess we could take the bus. Hello again. Oh, hello hero. How is the property? Um, awesome! It's gonna be tough to bring it back to life, but I'm looking forward to the challenge. Great! Though, I wish I hadn't missed the tour yesterday. I didn't realize there wasn't a house on the property. Oh, that's... Hmm. I know it's not much, but I could fix your phone free of charge. Maybe that'll help a little. That's kind of you. Thank you. There you go, fixed. I gave you some free apps, too. Should help keep you organized and such. A to-do list and the weather and utilities. One of them is actually a utilities app that I should have given you when you bought the land. It'll help you keep track of your water and electricity usage. Wow, that was quick. Thank you. Technology comes easy to me. So if you ever need anything, you come to Tech Hero, all right? All right, thanks, Hero. See you around. My phone got fixed for free. Do I have a crunchy? Look at that. Look at that shiny screen. Look at it. Well, I used a little bit of water. Oh my god, I used... I've stored electricity? Cool. Cool. What you doing there? Okay. Run 
Maintaining a homestead requires utilities like water and electricity. These natural resources provide necessary infrastructure to your farm and can be tracked through your utilities app. As you gain experience running your homestead, you'll discover new ways to collect these valuable resources. Some new methods may include wind and water turbines for electricity or water pumps for irrigation. The more you build, the more you'll learn. Okay. Oh, apparently I have 150 whatever, cupolas or whatever they called it to my name. Kashiwa Shrine, Town Hall. Okay, it's nighttime. Maybe? Is this a vending machine? I could use a vending machine. I'm hungry. That's cute. Alright, so then... Is that in my bento box? It is. That got a lot of my hunger. That got a little bit of my hunger. I do like this very open world feel. There's no loading screens, that's nice. I'll get better at the controls. Lighting is obviously beautiful. I'm really not sure how I'm supposed to get home. This town is cute. The map app, you can access the world map through the map app on your phone. Once open, use WASDA to move around. You can select different map locations to find out more about them and even place pins to make finding your destinations easy. <gasps> Man, having a phone is great. Sleeping is used not only to progress to the next day, but is also used when your game is saved. To sleep, interact with your tent. Eventually, you'll be able to build a new sleeping point anywhere you choose on your property. You'll always wake up in the last place you slept. If you don't sleep before 11.45, you'll pass out. Wow, okay, 11.45. That's, I mean, that's more reasonable than 2 a.m. like all the other games. Hey, I'm back with the strawberry seeds. Great. I can show you how to plant them if you like. Or do you think you can figure it out? All right, sure. Please help me. I have no idea what I'm doing. I've already ruined my hose, as you can see. <laughs> okay, so farming. Honestly, it's pretty simple. Ugh, but if there's any weeds in your way, you'll want to clear them out first. Weeds, they're really just plants that will fight your strawberries for nutrients and water. Is If there is a nata in the shed, mm -hmm. once the weeds are gone, you need to loosen up the soil. And then you plant the seed, give it watering. You can add fertilizer too if you want from Mrs. Watanabe's store. And that's it. Make sure you water it every day though. If you forget and miss a day, you might be all right, but miss too many and your plant will get stressed out and dry up. It'll die. That's bad. Yeah, that's bad. But once it grows some fruit, you can pick it and eat it. Even better, some plants give you the ability to grow more plants later, like strawberries. If you dry them out and collect the seeds, you can use those seeds to plant more strawberries. I've heard there are also other plants like that. Have flowers that produce seeds? I think Grandma called it the seedling stage. I honestly have no idea, so you'll have to try it out. And what's neat about strawberries is that they grow fruit all season long, even into the summer. They won't produce fruit in the fall or winter though, but if you leave the plant, it'll start producing again next year. Wait, plants will come back the next year? Only some of them. I think they're called perennials. You have to be careful where you plant those because they'll kind of be around forever. Grandma used to say that every plant was different and had its own personality, so you have to grow them to learn more about them. Farming sounds harder than I thought it would be. 
I think it just takes patience. And a willingness to fail? You'll get it. <laughs> Thank you so much for your help. No problem. I can't wait to see how they turn out. Strawberries are so versatile. And they're great in baked goods. When you harvest your first batch, you can make some strawberry muffins. I actually don't have a kitchen or a house, so. But you need to get some flour and sugar. I guess you could also put them in a nice salad, like the one my grandma used to make. I can text you the recipe later. Strawberries in a salad? Yeah, I can figure that out. Wait, you still don't have a house? No, it's only been a day. You're like surrounded by trees. Why don't you just build one? Uh, I wouldn't even know where to start. I don't even have an ax to cut the trees. Hmm, good point. That Nata definitely won't be able to handle trees. Maybe Master Ishikawa can help? No, he'll just talk your ear off. Best to avoid him for now. I think Hero will be the best place to get started for sure. You know, I heard Natalie talking about some new project Hero was working on. She said it was for some big architecture firm in the city. Something to do with building planning? Honestly, I zoned out. But I know Hero is always looking for people to test his crazy inventions. You should ask him about that. That sounds interesting. Thanks for your help, Kat. Did you happen to finish your paper? Oh yeah, took me all night, but I got it done. All right, I don't want to be late for class. Good luck with the strawberries. Bye. Thank you. All right, well, we grew our potatoes. I don't know that potatoes will come back. But we do have to water them. Nice. Oh, I got a text. Oh, she said she was going to text me the recipe. This is Sunny, right? Yeah? Great, it's Kat. I forgot to tell you about Sunny Seed. What's that? Is it an app? It's a super awesome company that sells seeds online. You know, in case you just don't want, want to grow just strawberries and potatoes. Oh, how do I get that? I'll send it to you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, okay, great, thanks. They also just released a companion app so you can look up information on seeds that aren't in season. End of conversation. Okay. Wow. Oh my god, there's like a sort? Okay, let's look at spring. We have potato, peppermint, spearmint, cucumber. We can do tomato. Two tomato. Two red bell pepper. Two cucumber. Try royal. The Sunny Seed Royal program allows us to show extra appreciation. You need to spend a thousand more dollars. Okay, let's check out. Oh, $25? Um, economy delivery. Three to five business days. Sure. Oh my god, we can add like a voucher? I don't have a voucher. Okay. All right. There's a grocery store. Okay. Well, I guess we are uh, hoofing it. This must be the grocery store. <laughs> cool. It's so cute. Can I buy something? Oh, it's, I come here. I come here. Oh, hello. Welcome to the oak tree. Very stylized. B 
beefsteak? I need something that doesn't need cooking. Oh, onigiri. Um, wow, white wine, sake, plum sauce. There's a lot of ingredients. Egg, honey, an umbrella, fabric, daikon, cabbage, bok choy, leek. Um, I'm gonna stick with onigiri and milk bread. Oh, where did you go? Where did you come from? Oh, you sit outside. All right, we have we're good on food. I feel. Oh, I just jumped. Let's go talk to Hero. For a crazy invention. Hello again. Hi, Hero. How's the farm? Actually, I want to talk to you about that. Oh? I wanted to add some buildings to the land. Kat said you'd be able to help? Of course she did. Oh, was she wrong? Not exactly. It's just that technically no one is supposed to know about it. Natalie must have told her. I've been working on a prototype survey drone that uses AR to plan large building projects. I call it the Aerial Building Assistant, or ABBA. That sounds pretty cool. It needs a lot of testing, though. I could help. I don't exactly love sleeping in a tent. I know what you mean. It's really not designed for a small property. Hmm. Okay, give me your phone. What? Why? I'm adding an app that will allow you to interface easily with the drone. Just open the app and the interface will allow you to control the drone and place blueprints on your land. This will help you plan out where and what you want to build, as well as help you figure out what you need to actually finish the project. Oh, I nearly forgot. You'll need a laptop for the drone. It's going to maintain all your blueprints and connect to the drone's GPS and... Oh, he gave me a laptop. Uh, the laptop completes the system. You can't use the drone's build mode without it. Only problem is, I don't have any blueprints. Those are usually added by the architect. <coughs> oh, I'm not really an architect. You're not, no. But Philip Obeng is. <gasps> really? Well, he used to be. His house is a bit hard to find, though. Here, let me see your phone again. I'm pinning his house on your map. Should make it easier to find. Your phone is fully connected to ABBA now, so anytime you place a pin on the map, the drone will project it like it does with the blueprints. What does that even mean? You'll see. Anyway, there are only a few modes on ABBA right now. You have free fly mode, a building mode, and a camera mode. I might add more later. I'll need to check in with you occasionally to update the software and collect data. Hope you don't mind. Not at all, this is really helpful. Thank you. Don't thank me yet. Let's see if it works first. Got it. Okay, the quest, the quest marker is telling us to go here. Oh. I should move out of the way first. Whoa, okay. soft wood. So this is to make components. Oh, I forgot I had strawberry seeds. We should put what's this game called Sunnyside okay I don't think I can craft anything though I'm kind of nervous about where to plant the strawberries because they're going to be there forever. Even though this is a demo, so it doesn't really matter.
I don't have fertilizer yet because I didn't know where the person was to do it. All right. This I could use some practice on also. Why can I? Okay, these two, okay, these two. Okay. All right. Strawberries. We did it. All right, here we go. Day two in the bag. If this does come out, we'll definitely play it on PlayStation because I'm having a lot of trouble with the PC controls. So this is gonna be, this is gonna be cute. We'll, we'll finish out the demo. We'll finish out all 10 days over the next couple weeks. Um, it should take a while because each day is set to be 20 minutes long. So there's only three days like in an hour. I will see you guys later. Thanks for coming by. Have a great rest of your day. Bye everybody.